Robert Frost was born on March 26, 1874, in San Francisco, California. His father, William Prescott Frost Jr., died from tuberculosis when Frost was just 11. After his father's death, he moved to Lawrence, Massachusetts with his mother and younger sister. Frost became interested in poetry in high school and from there enrolled at Dartmouth College in Hanover, New Hampshire in 1892 and then to Harvard University in Boston, but never got a college degree. Leaving school, he worked as a teacher, cobbler, and editor of the Lawrence Sentinel. His first published poem, entitled My Butterfly, was published in the New York newspaper, The Independent, on November 8, 1894. In 1895, Frost married his wife, Eleanor Miriam White, who he attended high school with and was a major influence in his poetry, until she died in 1938. The two moved to England in 1912 after failing at farming in New Hampshire. In England, Frost met contemporary British poets, like Edward Thomas, Rupert Brooke, and Robert Graves. Frost also formed a friendship with Ezra Pound, who aided in publishing Frost's poetry. When Frost returned to the United States due to World War I in 1915, he had already published two full-length collections, A Boy's Will in 1913 and North of Boston in 1914. By the 1920s, Frost was the most celebrated poet in America, publishing more works and eventually winning four Pulitzer Prizes. He also spoke at John F. Kennedy's presidential inauguration. Kennedy spoke of Frost, saying he has bequeathed his nation a body of imperishable verse from which Americans will forever gain joy and understanding. Frost died in Boston on, on January 29, 1963.